we've got cracking. Not seeing anything on that one yet. Playing a bit of Mozart, maybe. Mozart, is it? Yeah, <laughs> kind of a healthy growth on there. Just a bit of encouragement. You can hear that, right? Yeah, they'll be able to hear it. We can hear them tweeting, so. They're tweeting now. I don't know, you've got the noise of the big ducks. <laughs> Geese. Come on, baby. Look what's happening. It's just pushing that top bit off. Come on, baby. Oh, it's not flapping anymore. He had his little beak out, didn't he? Mm. He, she. I want it to be a she because we've got names for girls. Oh, look, look, look. It's happening. Look. Beep, 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 beep. Hello, baby. You can do it. I've got to go to school now. I know. I've got to go to school. I've got to go and do the school run. I'll come back and check in a couple of hours. Come on, baby. It's a little tiny hole. You having a little rest? It's quarter past nine and I'm stuck in traffic. <laughs> um, Sky will be doing the bus to do this school run. Um, but it's just because it's her first week we are sort of breaking it in slowly for her oh excuse me she came home on the bus yesterday but yeah this route is notorious for traffic so um we could just have a little chat so as you saw in that little clip the um chicks the goslings are hatching it's taking a while and Rob's just said to me, I know they say don't interfere, but it's been over 24 hours since they broke through, started to break the shell. And it's very slow going. So I might have to step in a little bit. I don't want to step in too soon because obviously if the membrane, if they've not drawn all the blood out of the membrane, they can bleed to death. And if they've not absorbed all their yolk then that can cause problems because that's like I guess the colostrum from the you know baby humans and animals um, you know it's important that they get that so I'm gonna pop back now um, let the dog out for a wee because it'll be sort of nearly 10 ish probably by the time I get home and uh, yeah just if the membrane on the second one hasn't broken it's got a tiny little hole in it if it's not broken then i'm going to pull a little bit back because the other problem is they can get too tired and die so it's that fine line do you help do you not help yeah i mean there's the some of the sites i've looked at have said don't help unless you're prepared to deal with a weak gosling but i'm you know hand rearing them and it's two it's not a flock so i can see if you're doing it for money purposes as in you know you are trying to get a whole flock of them for eggs or breeding or whatever then you know you wouldn't want a weak gosling but let's be honest all the animals in my house and birds are very much the underdogs you know they've all had a life either on the streets being dumped, being picked on, you know, I am the home for all creatures that do not have the best start, so, yeah, we'll give it a go, I think I might step in, and just hope for the best, hindsight would be very useful at this point, what happens if I don't step in, will they get tired and fatigued and die, 
or if I do step in, well, they die. <laughs> What I'd like to do is get home and find that they've both got their heads popped out and that I can just go, right, I can leave them to it. Their heads are out. Brilliant. Um, the fact that Rob has said he thinks I should step in at this point, I feel a bit more confident about because he's done it several times before. He's a farmer, you know, he's got experience with animals and birds and livestock. So it's not his first rodeo. Anyway, Ozzy's very excited. The other two have seen this thing before. Sky and Harry have seen this process before. And Ozzy hasn't. So, um, yeah, I'm going to bring Ozzy over after preschool. And he can come and have a look at them. So I want something for him to look at. I don't want a dead bird because that would be most disappointing for everybody. Excuse me. Oh, this traffic is so tedious. Right, I shall stop recording because it's already been four minutes and that's you know like at least a quarter of a vlog if it's a long vlog it's half a vlog if it's a short vlog so see you in a minute this one is starting to unzip here you can see the unzipping happening now this one is not unzipping this one is breaking through in a completely different manner I'm a little bit worried about the membrane on that one because you can see it's dropped down. But it's absorbing the yolk. There's still yolk in there, so it's doing what it needs to do. I'll come back in an hour and check on it. Um, humidity is still up, which is good. The temperature's not bad. It's not too hot for them. So I'm going to give them a little bit longer, but we're getting there. Back from the sheep. Everyone is happy. Place is a lot tidier and cleaner. And um, yeah, they're all out playing. So everybody's happy. I am now going to do a bit of housework. Um, I've got the bathrooms to clean. I did start it yesterday, but we were doing a lot with the sheep and what have you. And the school runs with Sky has taken a good two hours out of my day. Um, so I haven't got as much done as I would normally get done on a Tuesday. But I'm gonna do this bathroom. I'm then going to go and dust I'm going to go and clean Sky's furniture because it's covered in makeup. Um, I'm then going to go and dust the living room and then I shall work my way upstairs. I do also need to go and let Link out because obviously with kennel cough he can't come to Emma's with me, which was the plan. So Link is at home. Kenzie is being picked up at 1.40 so he'll be with him this afternoon and um, then I can focus a bit more on Work. but it also means I can go and check on the geese and how they're progressing with their hatching. It's all go, it's all babies. It's a very baby orientated Easter right now. I've never had so many baby things in my life all at one time. Right, cleaning. I need to go check on the dog and the goose eggs. And then I'm nabbing Brendan's car and getting Kenzie. Oh my goodness, they're out. You can do it, baby. You can do it. You're so nearly out. And you are out. Um, you just need to dry off, don't you? Hi, babies. Hi. Hi. Oh, you're so cute. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Come on, you can do it. You're having a little rest now. It's hard work, isn't it? It's hard work. You can do it, baby. Right, the babies are out. You just need to rest now. and They need to um, dry off. This is so super exciting. Oh, look at them. I've picked Kenzie up and now I need to this pile of clothes away. Harry did a lot of his clothes yesterday for me. There's some more out here from yesterday's washing. So I'm going to pick those up, sort Emma's pile out and put that in her room, take the dirty laundry down, do the bathroom, hoover. I do need to pick the kids up too. Both bathrooms are sparkly clean. I need to go and do the school run. That's just perfect timing. I need to go and grab the kids from school. And Ozzy wants to see the geese, and I promised him I'd take him to have a look at the eggs. Well, now he's going to get more than eggs, isn't he? He's going to get baby geese. Oh, she's falling. Careful, she's falling out the bottom. Oh, oh. 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 
she was falling out the bottom, Ozzy. That's it. Can you do it? Good boy, that's it. Oh! <laughs> She's got a bit flappy now, has she? Do you like Gloria? Yeah, you're a Yeah, she's lovely. There are, Kenzie's got her. And who have you got? Peppa. Nagini. 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 Where's she going? Oh, the tail's in your pocket. Oh, look, we've got everybody. Everyone's come to join us. We've got Salem and, and then the new additions. Look, have you come to see the new additions? Have you come to see the new additions? Because you're so happy about all the new things arriving. Come on then, come and have a look. They're the geese. We have a new cat now. You do have a new cat, don't you? It's the geese. Oh, and she's gone, Ozzy. Oh, Ozzy. Is she on your shoulder? She does like you. Yeah. Link's giving her a look, a little look. Is she talking to you? God, the noise. Yeah. Oh, is it? Yeah. That's it. You gonna lift her, Kenzie? That's right. You can just grab her. She's fine. Well done. She's fine. She's fine. A yummy dinner of a pork patty, the garlic bread, which Ozzy will not want any of. And the same for Harry. I know you don't want any. You never do. Okay, well, it's fine. There you go, you can eat that bit. Okay. Goats are wanting their tea. So. This door seems to be sticking. Oh. It's really sunny and warm. I am very warm, in fact. It's lovely. A bit blowy. Oh, you get milk everywhere. So oh, nice. Good job, Ozzy. Getting into your baby wipes. That's like saying the knife actually made it work. Yeah. <laughs> he, I love the fact that he said he needed his knife. So he knew not to use a sharp one. He was using his own knife. Good job, Oz. They're for the... Oh, wow. They are a bit bigger than you thought. That They're drain pipe, aren't they? There was like so many different sizes, and my millimeters clearly are quite. Um, did you misjudge? I did. Yeah, I'll say that's not going to hold it, is it? Yeah. <laughs> and we've got more, more collars for. Who are these for? Well, um, the lambs. There was meant to be two of those. I'm going to have to order another one. Like baby goats. Baby goats, and. When they get bigger, I take oh, it. Um, Baby, um, There's not a blue one, sweetie. Um, the baby. No. These no. aren't really dinky ones, to be fair. They're not actually. Blue one. They are smaller, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah. The bells are coming tomorrow. I've got the oh. little brass bells. The smaller versions. Yeah, they have. So, so I thought it actually probably better to get the used to. Yeah, yeah. Um, the dingling. Um, and also the goats can have bells because goats have bells. Don't they? Our goats will have bells. Our goats will have bells. <laughs> yeah. I mean, admittedly. Um, you won't miss them the cotton balls, no. They had them, but they... Oh, they came off, didn't they? Very, very yeah, quickly, they did. So, um, did not approve of bells. Yeah, yeah, we won't worry about them ones too much, but... Um, cool! Yeah, so that's it, really. The baby bells have arrived yeah, in the other package. Yeah. Thanks, Oz. Yeah. Yeah. How are we doing, babies? Why are you fluffing up now? Come on. Oh. One baby. the cutest bundle of wonderfulness I ever did see. You are the cutest bundle of amazing. Look at you. Oh, your big feet. Oh, baby! Careful! Careful! Don't flop out. So slow. Look at them! Oh. Lee, come oh. look at them! You 
okay you have to show people your face because i've never seen you look so oh, come down here come down here to the camera look look little chirpy things <laughs> would you like a baby i'm fine thank you fine thank you hello aren't they amazing they're very nice look at them they're a lot bigger than i thought they'd be this is daddy duck hi daddy duck hello no you're daddy duck well not duck daddy deuce I'm Mummy Goose. So let's have a look at you individually. All the dust coming off. Getting covered in goosiness. Right, let's check you out. You've got two wings. You've got two wings and you're all yellow around the middle. That's cute. And you've got big white pink feet and a pink beak. This one came out of a mucky egg. This is the one that was struggling. There you go. And you, oh, careful, baby. Careful. Do you want to try? You have a cuddle. You are much darker in colour. And you've got dark little feet and a much darker head. So we'll be able to easily tell you apart. Dusty, isn't it? You're covered in dusty stuff. Oh. What is it? The casings for the feathers, isn't yeah. it? Like Gloria had when she started to grow all her feathers back. It's okay. Oh. 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 <laughs> it's, this goose likes to go splat. Right. Beautiful geese. Oh, you're having cuddles. Oh, is that nice? I'm going to go to sleep on my hands. You said they're both hatched. Yeah, I'm glad they both hatched as well. They both look healthy. It's takeaway night, and what did Link get given? He got given a sausage. He got given a sausage by the fish and chip people. Wow, Link. Let's not give him the whole sausage. No, maybe half a quarter cut into half. A little bit of sausage because of his belly still being not 100%. Yeah. You're going to cough like twice when you're sick. Well done, Link. That, did that, you that get a sausage? There. That other dog there, I think. Like, Link can't take No, he's meal. got to be away from them. Oh, I've it's, asleep. it's takeaway night. Lee's got cheesy beans and chips. What have you got, Kenzie Bear? Cheese Burger and, and chip, chips. I'm saving my chips. So Are I'm you? Watch the Mandalorian. Uh, and I've got chicken and chips. I love the crispy chicken. What do you think, Gloria? Hi, Salem. What do you think? I know I keep bringing new things into the house, don't I? It all started with you, Salem. This is what happens. Gloria, have you been in the mud again by any chance? I've just checked on all of these lovely eggs, cooling them down slightly, and now I can give them a spritz. I've cleaned out the um, incubator because it was covered in egg in it. We want it all nice and clean for the ducks to go back in. So, put this on. This is quite wet, so I'm not going to put any water in there at the moment. Lay out these four again. Like I said, I've checked on them. They are growing. They are moving. Now my sister's taking over the hatching of these because I am meant to be, the spog's fixed, going to Anglesey over the coronation weekend. And that is when they're due to hatch. So they're going to do the honours. 
they will film everything and make sure that we are kept apprised of everything that happens. <laughs>